Lost his love. Now what happened was Well, that's the origin of the word slave. That's right. However, in 1441, two Moors were captured in Morocco by Portuguese. This was one of the first times you see our people being reclassified, not as Moors, but as Negros, by way of Portuguese uh, rule, if you will. Two Moors were captured by Portuguese and delivered to who they call Prince Henry the, the, Henry the Navigator. He's called Prince Henry the Navigator, but he navigated nothing. <laughs> when he was delivered to Henry, whom they call the Navigator, Henry was like, oh wow, this is a, a grand economic opportunity. So what he did, he contacted Pope Eugene the Fourth and alerted him of this idea of, re, of capturing Moors and reclassifying them as Negroes. The response of Pope Eugene IV was, oh wow, yes, capture these Moors, and guess what? This will be a continuation of the Crusades, Islam? Yeah. So, what started out as a religious crusade ended up with the enslavement of a whole nation of people. Pope Eugene IV, by way of his papal bulls, established international sanctioned slave trade and created a lawful framework for the international trade of Moors who are now reclassified as, Le as Negroes, now being an enslaved group of people. So what started out with the Portuguese, continued with the Dutch, continued with the French, and then with the British, Islam? Islam. Now stop at the British, because 1774, that date is not a haphazard date. To understand 1774, you gotta go two years prior. You gotta go to 1772. Now what happened in 1772? This is pertaining to the, the Somerset case. Somerset versus Stewart. Now what happened was, you had a, a, a Moorish brother who was uh, by the name of, of, of James Somerset, who was enslaved by a Charles Stewart in Virginia. Then he was taken from Virginia to England. The brother James Somerset, he got away, ran away, and when he ran away, he was recaptured. And when he was recaptured, the, the, court, the case went to trial and in regards to whether or not this individual, James Somerset, was to remain enslaved. So by 1771, when the case went to trial, the, the order was given in 1772. The order was that James Somerset was no longer to be considered a slave on British soil, was huh? So remember, at that time, there was no United States of America. There were 13 colonies, each separate chartered and governed under European rule. They were under the jurisdiction of Britain. So when this got back to the colonists, they said, oh, wow. If they're declaring that James Somerset is no longer to be considered a slave, oh, that message is going to come back to the colonies. So what they did was devise a plan to mark our people. See, 1774 is when the marks of Negro, black, and colored was put on our people. 1779, the marks were translated into slave names. Islam? Islam. Our last names are slave names. Slave names are Negro, black, colored, and Ethiopian. Islam? Islam. So, 
September 5th was the meeting of the first Continental Congress. And that is why we stand today in front of this building that is known as Carpenters Hall because this is the site of the first Continental Congress which met between the dates of September 5th and October 26th, 1774. They met under the guise of what was known as the Odd Fellows Convention. Islam? Islam. So on September the 5th, 1774, the Moors were a divided and defeated nation here in North America. And that was only because we divided ourselves. We were in Moorish Spain, ruling Moorish Spain, but the decline of Moorish Spain did not happen in 1492. It happened hundreds of years prior to 1492. You had sultans dividing themselves into kingdoms. I'm the Sultan of Seville. I'm the Sultan of Granada. I'm the Sultan of Valencia. And we would actually have armies fighting each other. And while we were fighting each other, the European was coming together. The Aragon and the Castile, Isabella and Ferdinand. In 1474, they came together. Four years later, 1478 was what? The Spanish Inquisition. The Spanish Inquisition was aimed at the enslavement and denationalization of the Moors. Islam? Islam. So there, there was a lead up to what happened here in 1774. And this is a record of what happened in Moorish Spain. And this is documented in the story of the Moors of Spain by Stanley Lane Poole. This is the, the European calling us infidels. It says the infidels were ordered to abandon their native and picturesque costume and to assume the hats and breeches of the Christians, to give up bathing and to adopt the dirt of their conquerors and to renounce their language, their customs and ceremonies, even their very names, and to speak Spanish and behave Spanishly. The wholesale denationalization of the people was more than any fault. Because the type of slavery that we experienced was a form of slavery unlike no other. Other nations who experienced slavery, when they came out of slavery, they came out still knowing themselves. When we came out of slavery, we had no idea of our identity, for, uh, about our legacy from which we came, and where we are going. Islam, Islam. So, September 5th, 1774, the Moors were a divided, divided and defeated nation here in North America. On that day, 12 European colonies met here in this building, Carpenter's Hall. It was a Masonic convention. The popular name of this convention, according to European history books, is the First Continental Congress. It must be made known that these 12 colonies that met were actually European nations. In 1774, there was no United States of America. There were 13 separate colonies, each separately chartered and governed. Now, how do we get European nations from 13 colonies? Each colony was composed of European nations under, under British rule. The state which we're currently in, Pennsylvania, was composed of European nations such as the Dutch, and the Germans and the Swedes. The state of New York was initially called New Netherland. That colony was renamed New York after the Duke of York, the future King James II of England. These European nations or colonies convened here at Carpenter's Hall in 1774. The First Continental Congress, they had represented representatives from all colonies except for Georgia. Two main documents which came out of the meeting of the First Continental Congress was the Declaration and Resolves, which was passed today, October 14, 1774, and the Articles of Association, which was passed October the 20th, 1774. At this very meeting, the issue of the justification of the enslavement of Moorish inhabitants and land 
was discussed and debated. The, the 12 colonies agreed to strip the Moors of their nationality and birthright, which was an act of European psychology by way of the slave marks, the slave marks of Negro, black, and color. Names that had nothing to do with our forefathers, Islam Islam. And we got to make that plain because a lot of our people are confused and thinking that they are black and thinking black is a proper identifier for them when it is not. It is actually an adjective. It's not a noun. It describes a noun. And the prophet says that black, according to science, means what? Death. It means death. And even getting into the etymology of the word black. It comes from a Proto-Indo-European root. Blaka, Blake. The word bleach is connected to the word black. It means pale. How does that equate to death? Pale or mortis, which is the paleness of death, which is one of the first stages of death. Islam moves. Pale or mortis. Rigor mortis, Islam, the stiffening of the joints, which leads to black putrefaction, which is the decaying of the cells, Islam. Now, people will try to tell you, well, black is all right. Kim, it means black. It means land of the black people. That's not true. Teach, the word Kemet is connected to the word chemistry, alchemy which is the art of transformation, Islam moves. When you go from your lower self to your higher self, that is an alchemical process, Islam. So when people try to put that on you more, let them know that we never identified ourselves as black. It would say, well, brother, Osiris means Lord of the perfect black. Well, you ask them, well, what did Osiris represent? He represented death in the underworld. Islam. So black, it is a mark, it is a badge of social and political and economic servitude. Black originally had nothing to do with skin complexion. You had Europeans who are classified as black. Why? Because black describes a condition. It's not more. So Negro, black, and colored, we got to get up off those names as well as those principles because it deludes to nothing but slavery. It's not more. And this is why you had moors such as the sundry free moors of South Carolina who knew themselves, who wanted to clarify their legal status. They wanted to be clear. If any of them were convicted of a crime. They did not want the Negro Act to be read, nor to be classified under black codes, because black codes were slave laws. So the sundry free moors, Daniel, Samuel, Hammond, and Francis, and their wives proclaimed who they were as, as subjects to a prince in alliance with this government. What is that a reference to? The first treaty the longest unbroken treaty between the United States and the so-called foreign government. The Peace and Friendship Treaty and ship signals between Morocco and the United States of America. Islam Islam. Islam. The strategy, plan or conspiracy of the Europeans is as follows. If the Moors were ever emancipated or set free in the future, the Moors would remain subjugated or dominated by the European race who had the sole authority in the classifying system by way of race, which incorrectly is being distinguished as colors, such as so-called black race and white race. And the origin of that, and you tell our brothers and sisters, that if you're promoting black, you are promoting European psychology because that originated with a German anthropologist by the name of Johann F. Blumenbach. Islam Islam. 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 The slave classifying system was designed for the purpose so that the Moors would forfeit and unknowingly forfeit their rights to true citizenship. 
the Moors known illegally as black people would rob themselves of the precious rights of citizenship by accepting and identifying with the slave marks of Negro, black, and color. None of these names pertains to a true nation of people. Now one may wonder, why is this information on the act of the First Continental Congress stripping the Moors of the identity is not known? Where is the record at? The record of the meetings of the First Continental Congress are known as the journals of the Continental Congress. And they are the records of the daily proceedings of the Congress as kept by its office secretary, Charles Thompson. Now the journals were printed contemporaneously in different editions and several subsequent editions. However, none of these editions included the secret journals, which were confidential sections of the record, which was not published until 1821. This complete edition was published by the Library of Congress between 1904 and 1937. The prophet declared that he freed all the secrets. Islam, Islam. Islam. Now, one must note that these secret journals were published during the contemporary of Prophet Noble Drew Ali. Now, what we want to share right now is what they're offering at the Library of Congress in, re in regards to what happened, what's, what's the record, what, what are the minutes of what happened at the meeting in 1774. Get a good uh, picture of it. This is a copy of the journals of the First Continental Congress, Volume 1, 1774. Now, show, show them what they put into the public now. Show the boys what they put now to the public. I got you. These are the records that they're putting out right now. And when you look at the record, you'll see large sections of the minutes of the record redacted. So the question is, what are you trying to hide? Who are you trying to protect? This was criminal activity that was going on. That's why you see blatant large chunks just, just totally obfuscated from the record. Now what's deep is this. I tried to price a complete copy of the journals. They will mark the price up for the complete journals to like $27,000 to make it extremely difficult to obtain the record of what occurred in 1774. It's lying, Moors. You see this, Moors? So people ask, well, how can you stand on this? We stand on the words of the prophet. It's lying, Moors. Now, it was reported that the raging debate was summarized with this statement, reportedly said, if we would agree to take the pheasants and turbans off the Moors heads and remove the sandals from their feet and enforce it with severe punishment and also to swear a death oath between ourselves to religiously and faithfully not to allow anyone to teach Moors children who they are and that they were not Negroes, Blacks, and colored folks that 200 years from today, 1774, Moors people would not know the nationality nor the national name of their forefathers. Also, they would not know from which land their ancestors are descended from. Now, I want to give honor to uh, my brother Bathia Il, who brought something to my attention that jogged my memory to a record that was first introduced to me by the Weaver Bay family. Praise Allah. Islam, Sister Weaver Bay, still here? Praise Allah, Moore's communication. Because in that record, they give a statement. They bring to the forefront of our mind a statement that is actually supporting what was demonstrated in 1774. And the statement was given by a congressman by the name of Henry Berry in 1832. And he made this statement on the floor of Congress. He says, we have, as far as possible, closed every avenue in which light 
may enter the slave's mind. Hmm. We have to only go one step further to extinguish the capacity to see the light and our work would be complete. They would then be reduced to the level of the beast of the field and we should be safe. Right? Right. So today we stand and manifest destiny of the plan of Almighty God, Allah. You see, man plans a plan, and Allah plans a plan, and Allah is the best of planets. Islam is. And when I look at the sea of fezzes and turbans, all I can say is thank you, Almighty God, Allah, for sending the Holy Divine Prophet, Noble Draw Ali. Islam is. So we're going to take some pictures in front of Carpenter's Hall. Some of us may go in and make a small purchase, and we're gonna make haste to come right out and make our way to independence. All right? Islam. Islam. Yes. Uh, ten minutes. Ten minutes. More. Is ten minutes. And when we take our picture, we don't have to use everyone's cell phone. You know, once again, you pictures are forwarded to everybody else. Islam. Islam. So let's take a picture. We're gonna make haste and not block the door. The brothers who want to stand in the top. <laughs> Our children, we want them in the front. Islam moves. Let's, let's get in place. This brother right here, I tell you, he shouldn't be. We gonna make him a righteous Moorish comedian. He just makes me laugh every time I see him. I, I love him. For real. Sir, get out the way, sir. <laughs> hey, bro. See this brother? That brother right there. He acts. Talk to my brother real quick. They actually have a uh, charter school in Tennessee. He's actually a school teacher. <laughs> you know, he's actually a school teacher. And so when people ask about where's the Moorish school, where, well, you have to be in more circles to know that these things exist. You see what I'm saying? You have to be in more circles. But, uh, I like to mess with him a lot. I don't see his wife out here, but he's like hilarious to me. So it's not more. So look, we gonna, um, I'm going to show you all a little bit more, and then I want to save some of my battery for the next event, you know, um, so we can be able to... Uh, share uh, this whole event with the family. So I'm going to go to my camera real quick so I can get a good picture. Uh, but uh, this is a beautiful sight right now. Let me, uh, let me show y'all real quick. Sister Hope! Sister Hope! Sister Hope! I'm gonna catch up with you. It's long. Barzell. I got, I got, I got, I got fresh Barzell hair. This the Grand Sheik. Excuse me, brother. Hey, brother, what you hiding from? I think the Grand Sheik hiding from. I'm, 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 I'm not the Grand Sheik. you not. But you, you still my Grand Sheik. Nah, you still my Grand Sheik. Nah, how about that? It's long. Who talk to you when I finish? Man. I don't document this for the people. Look at this. This looks nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> get the picture. Mm -hmm. No, not yet. Not yet. Get the picture. I got, I got a document for the people. I got a job. I got, I got a service to people. You know what I mean? Look at that. Goodness of grace. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Y'all see this here? Y'all think it's a game? God think it's a game, didn't the prophet tell y'all about this day? Oh, I'm sorry, sis, you know how I get down. <laughs> y'all see that? Sorry. Look at that. Y'all see that? Look, I just gotta mess with some people, man. Look, when y'all come around Moorish Americans with culture and demonstrating this right here, you just want to have just a good time, man. You just, you know what I mean? That's like, that's, see, it's like, like family, you know? Listen, that internet movie science, I really can't relate to. That's why I get so pumped up on that. I like, I like, the, I like this type of movie science. <laughs> that's what I like, right there. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. And then we we'll talk about it too. Y'all on the internet doing that? Y'all need look. look at that. It's that it's internet movie science. I didn't get up in that. It's the, it's the, I'll be back shortly, more. Let me just. Uh, you got my camera? Well, I want you to take a camera. I want you to take a picture with this, if you will. Give this to TJ. TJ, hold this. You want to get in, TJ? You all right? Oh, pardon me, bro. Pardon me, bro. Damn, okay. I'm about to get you right.
Okay? And all you gotta do is press this. Press this, but make sure it's make sure it's even. So let me knock it out. I'm gonna get in some. Make sure. You, let me see. I'm gonna try to get in this picture, family, while I'm live. Watch it. I'll take two more. I'll count. One, two, three. Let's try more. Three. One, two, three. Islam. One more. You got me. Three. One, two, three. Islam. Uh, I had to, I had to take a club picture. Me, 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 me and my sister, we had to take the club picture. You know I mean? And her husband, look at, yo, that was the beach picture, Mo. <laughs> That's the beach picture. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, but family, this is what the Morris Science Temple of America is all about. This is what the love is all about. This is what our profit is all about. All of us coming together. This right here is probably a conglomerate. Um, probably six different bodies and groups and factions and only one that. temple, exactly. one body. Exactly. That's what I'm trying to get to. Bro. Ain't no confusion out here. Ain't no confusion. He's trying to host Ain't my no show. Ain't no different bodies. It's look, only one. Look, look. He's trying to host There's my show. only one body. See, one host. temple. See, one he get, prophet. He get loud like the Alcabe too. Yeah. Nihau. Nihau. Don't Look at my brother on phone. He can't shake my hand because he's so busy. I'm about to... <laughs> yeah, he on, yeah, he on point. He on point. So look, so what I'm, what I'm saying is though, family, you know, this is even Taj here. Taj Tariq Bay here. Where, where can I get? Let me get him real quick. Let me get him. Hey, hey I want y'all share this. I want, I want y'all share this real quick. I want y'all share this real quick. Islam, Mazel. Islam. 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 So we live again, family. Look. Y'all see who here? We live again. We pull up in here. Y'all see that? Who that? Who that right there? Who that right there? That's right. Corbin Banks. Corbin Banks. Brother Taj Shereen. And Brother Sahaka Banks. Negative technique. That's right. Negative technique. That's right. Here we go. Here we go. Y'all think it's some division going on? That's on the internet. Stop playing with yourself. Unity is the call of the day. Nation one. Nation one. It's love. It's love. It's Y'all see this right here? The Hawk of Bay and Taj Act right. You got that right. All day. Act right. Act right. It's love. Y'all see that family? Family, this is what it's really about, man. Y'all think it's a game, man. This thing about to come together in ways that you've never seen before. Real talk. It's about to come together in ways that you've never seen before. So y'all, y'all can keep all up the, the confusion. We are gonna make this thing like the prophet said. It's gonna be a sea of turbans and phases everywhere. So y'all can have your own thing going on. Watch. Y'all just stay tuned. Just a little bit more time. Stay tuned. Watch y'all. Watch how it's so and weave all together. That ain't she. That ain't she. Boy, good brother. The Hugger Bay. That's right. Keep over line, and let me tell you. His father, his father, watching his father showed me how to be humble. I watched him tack his father through the years, and he just demonstrated. He just demonstrated. Honor to the Supreme Grand Chief Craig Bell. I just had to throw that in. I just, more because they attacked him more. No, I watched it more. I've been around for a long time. You feel me? See, see, this is what it's all about, family. It's on the family. See, that's where the love is. It's love. It's love. Tell them that. Tell them how we got a shout out. Hey, oh yeah, we get all our shout outs. What happened? Hey, listen. See, what they don't understand from a part of the beginning of your journey, I was there. You know, First morning we met, she was on our way. I was, love, guess what? Right. I said, go to Temple 34. That's and right. now she, that's right. nobody in Temple 34 get mad at me. But she's the shining light of the sister of Zillian of Temple number 34. Gratitude. And I can't wait to make my we way up there brother. to go up there and support. That's right. I'm telling you. Y'all doing beautiful work. Y'all doing beautiful work. It's love. It's love. It's love, family. But I'm trying to tell you, family. Look, that, that, that sister right there and her husband, um, at that point, I didn't have, I didn't, I wasn't, I wasn't, I, I've been a grand sheep, but my temple wasn't open at the time, and I was, you know, trying to get the documentation for everybody, and they came to me, and they was like, 
what, 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 what should I do? And I sent them to my brother, um, Temple Number Thirty Four. I, I hope I can catch up with them now. Walk with me, brother. Hold that, DJ. Um, so Temple Number Thirty Four, and they've been there ever since. They are shining light of Temple Number Thirty Four in New York. It's all um, my. It's all um, we in the building. We looking good. Yeah. Damn! Look at this. Look at this. Jenny, look at the young moon. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Y'all see that? See that? Y'all think it's a see y'all think it's a game. Any rappers on turf. Y'all think it's a game, don't y'all? It's not a game, family. It's not a game. Hold up, let me find, let me find my uh, my son. I gotta find some people. I'm I'm all over the place, family. But listen, this Morris Science Temple of America paradigm is all about. It's all about coming together, finding a way. <laughs> it's love, brother. You gotta make it here. It's love. It's love. My bad, my bad. Hold up, hold up. Don't give him no speech yet. We're going to give him a speech in a minute. We're going to give him a speech in a minute. Islam? Islam. Islam. That's my son. In the building. In the building. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to say something. Give, look. That's a noble, Islam. That's a noble Temple secretary right there. Islam. In the building. Peace and love. And the Muftias. You know it. The Muftias. You know it. <laughs> and that's the beautiful princess. Islam. <laughs> Islam. Islam. So look. So look, but I'm trying to find my brother before I close out real quick. Cause that's my brother. It's all my brother. It's long. Now, let me get a picture real quick. Wait for me, family. It's all my brother. So look, so look, family. This is what it's all about. I, I, I'm trying to find my brother, right? Who seen my brother? It's long, mo. See, I was trying to get y'all to Brother Cyberzell. Cyberzell got something going on real big. You know, y'all might want to purchase some of these tennis shoes that he got. So I was trying to get him on. I'm telling you, we got more designers out here. We got superstars out here. He out here? Oh, I thought you just, oh, he went inside. Yeah, we got superstars. Islam, 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 Islam. Ah, I love you, boy. Hey, boy, you, you see my picture, right, man? <laughs> hey, boy, you know you gotta give me one more, right? Looking good. Hey, boy, you see? Of course, many of you like. <laughs> hey, look, the picture that y'all see me on—that's my iconic picture. This is the brother that took the picture. <laughs> Man, yeah. love, That's love. the brother. The iconic picture with me. I use it for everything. <laughs> it's, it's like a logo now. That's all I can do. You don't need a house without real money. But <laughs> what type of degree you get? The gold and silver for the citizens alone. He got a piece of silver. Hold on, hold on. We got that. We got that. I knew you were coming after me. What is that? I knew it was coming. That's the silver. The gold and silver is for the citizens alone. We got that. Tell them, tell them in Russian what we were looking at. Tell him in uh, Japanese what we're looking at. <laughs> Man, this guy. Look, this brother texts me this stuff. I'll be like, Islam, okay. I'm going to go to work now. Let me call him up later. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> I'm hopefully he's saying something good. I'll be like, Alhamdulillah. Okay. <laughs> but, um, yeah, family, this is what it's all about. They're taking some time right now to take pictures. But Moorish Americans are in the building or on the ground, on the land, whatever you want to call it. You know what I mean? This is our land. <laughs> so look, look, my son is something else. I'm trying to tell you. You all right? You all right? Get, get the fans wet. We getting that one. Anyway, family, let me see what's going on here. I'm trying to get y'all. Let me let me walk y'all around one more time, and I'm going to save my battery. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to save my battery. No, not yet. We wait till we go inside. We about to go inside in a minute, brother. You gotta wait till I set up the. <clears throat> we got one more location and then to the uh, to the lunch hall. Um, hold on one sec. Let me walk in right here. There it is. That, that my sisters right there. Look, right there. Sis. How are you doing? Y'all see? See, I get excited, so I, I got calmed down. See, when Moorish America's in the building, when the sister's in the building, Brother Jahar be like, that's what I'm talking about. Because I, I come from a place, you know, on the internet, all we is Moors, the male Moors just running their mouth. You know what I mean? Da, 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 da. All the males know everything, you know what I mean? So
the sisters in the building. But y'all gotta hold up. <laughs> hey sis, you know, I'm doing good. But your husband, right? He acting up. Hey, y'all gonna catch this one. I don't. I ain't tripping. Now he in love. He ain't got no time for me. <laughs> Now to hawk a bear in love, found him a mobitis, he ain't got no time for me. Yeah. But he said it loud too. So I might as well say it while I'm live on Facebook. It is what it is. Anyway, we're going to walk around a little bit. Family, I'm glad y'all joined me today. Y'all looking real good in the numbers here. Um, man, this is just a beautiful sight. Islam, sis. See, this is all family right here. Look at the family. Look at the young Moorish American. Y'all got to be saying this is all family here. How you feel, brother? You good? I'm coming to New York soon to y'all temple. You, you going to receive me? You going to receive me, brother? <laughs> See what I'm talking about? That's the next generation that's ready to unfold these blessings. Press your hand, move. Yes. Oh, my. I know my name, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Continue your work. Yes, sir, brother. Appreciate you, yes, brother. No problem. Good, no good. Problem. See, that's this. Look, here you go, here you go, here you go. Here you go. Get him again. I gotta get him again. I gotta get him again. No, there you go. He likes so diplomatic. My brother's so diplomatic. <laughs> this is my brother here. Look at him. He's so diplomatic. Brother, can I get an interview, please? Absolutely not. <laughs> hey, brother. Where your wife at? She went home with the child. Man, I'm gonna get. Tell her I'm getting upset. I'm about to do a show on her. You think I'm serious? I'm gonna do a more short TV show on your wife. <laughs> Sister, we was out in Philadelphia. Yeah. She was out in Philadelphia. You didn't go. And you got the baby at home. The baby's supposed to be right here. It's like, I'm playing. I hope you don't watch this, sis. I'm only playing. She from Brooklyn? The Bronx. Oh, no, I don't want no trouble. I don't want no trouble. Look, I'm trying to give y'all all the documentation I can before my battery run dead. Most people uh, uh, may not be able to see this, so I'm trying to give you everything I can before my battery run dead. Hold up, let me get that sheet real quick. This is this is the organizer, Temple Number Eleven. Here's my, bro my brother and my friend, my spiritual advisor, because sometimes I get off the cuff and that brother, matter of fact, both of this brother called me too, to be a check, but in love, you know, not check me, but they be like, Mo, I agree with you, Mo, Mo, you need to do something in love, Mo, make sure you put love on for family. These is the term. This brother call me random and do it. This brother do too. Now here's the security. There you go. I can't stand security sometimes. Rules always gotta have all these rules. They gotta be so disciplined. No, family. It's all love, but this just how it is. Family, this is a beautiful sight right here. Let me grab my jacket. You got me more. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is the brother I want to get right here. Hey, more, more. I'm just trying to document for the people, more. The people, more. The people. It's better to serve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On the very top. On the very top. On the weather vane. On the weather vane. See, let me show you what they look like. Look at, look at that. Look at that. The same way if you do the some square. People, some people do this, they'll say this. That's the square, ain't it? If you're looking at it, that's the square. That means you have been in the east. If you're not looking at it, if it's upside down, it means you have you have because it's a certain way. If you're sitting in the east, you see it. And if you're not, it would be upside down. Right. Yeah. This is my big brother right here. I'm trying to tell y'all, this is the Grand Chica Temple number 34. The, the whole temple coming on the show real soon. I'm trying to tell you. This is the, this is the shit here. We got to build. We got to get on there and build. Yeah, you got my collar in here. This is it. This, brother, you, I, hey, I wanted to um, I wanted to say if you got race pride and you love your race, join the more side Temple of America. Then you will have power to redeem your race. So you will know who you are. You can go for this work. 
And, and big shout out to my brother right here, brother, brother Parker Bay is doing a powerful thing. You know, keep it up, bro. And, bro, and y'all need to go to his page and check out his. He got some serious tennis shoes Love. on the market yeah, right are, now. Love. From how the tennis shoes? Are. Hey, uh, it, we, about, we making history. Now, you know, I, I was always the, uh, the, the the prince of the sneaker industry. They they had me locked in a dungeon for a long time. So. You know, be on the lookout for that. Uh, Giza Olympias, go, you can go to at Giza Olympias on Instagram and connect to the website, GizaOlympias.com. Go and to GizaOlympia.com. G-I-Z-A. W-W-W-G-I-Z-A. Olympia.com. That's right. And check out them demonstrations. I'm trying. We're making history. It's history in the making. I'm going to Temple 34 real soon because I miss my family in the NYC. Looking dapper. Looking super dapper as usual. That's my brother right there. And the brother, the sister from the sister, the auxiliary that y'all just seen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, That's Sister Elberry Bay. Sister yeah. Elberry Bay. Sister Elberry Bay. Sister uh, Brother T. Right. A. Berry Bay. Uh, uh, those are amazing so moons. Look, look out for that. I can't even tell you. I can't even tell you why. Brother C. Martinell. Uh, sister, congratulations to Sister D. Harris Hill. She became chic this year out of it's Chicago. Wrong. Praise the Lord. The moons is uh, a law sending the men. And listen, you know? if you are in the New York tri state area, especially in Brooklyn area, inbox me so I can send you directly to Temple 34. Thank you, brother. brother Three plus that. four is seven. Go on, get there. <laughs> Let's do the science. Do the math. Brother, can you, tell, can you tell the people who you are, brother? I'm all up. In human form. See what I'm talking about? DJ Bre Supreme. Y'all y'all need to Google brother DJ Supreme. Legend in the game. Legend in the game. Morris American. Law the person. Et cetera, et cetera. Mm -hmm. Peace. They see love. me on Facebook with a different name, but Facebook's a video game. Well, well, well you, they, how about that, brother? How about that? And and y'all need to get y'all need to get out there to be with the Moors and maybe y'all know some people sometimes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Me and the brother met in NYC. Indeed. You know what I mean? We in Philadelphia now. We everywhere, you never there. <laughs> you know what I mean, brother? Morris <laughs> Brown TV. Morse, that's Morris Brown TV. In the See what I'm saying? Everybody know about Morris Brown TV because we everywhere. We're going we gonna to let the world know what the Moors are doing. We're going to let the world know. Fox ain't going to tell that story. Morris Brown TV going to And I'm going to turn up on the misinformation. <laughs> and I'm going to turn up on the misinformation. How about that? So with that family, we're about to go to the next destination, right? And... I'm gonna set up my camera on that destination and um and I'm gonna upload that. Catch me on YouTube. I think I'm gonna do this next one on YouTube. I gotta put some footage on YouTube for the other audience because we got two different audiences. You follow me? So um this is this is this is this is the thing, this is the thing, this is the thing, this is the thing. When we come into our own, right? Like we come to events like this and we come into our own family, you can feel the love. A thousand miles away. Watch. All I want to do is document this demonstration. Look at that. We in the building, family. No. That's right. We in the building. We in the building. That's right. We in the building. So look, I got to get up walk here. But listen. Y'all ready? What time you and uh, your wife? And so look. So this is the thing. This is what we working towards in the noble temples. For events like this, for active Moorish Americans, you know, that's trying to do something or think their conditions can be better. Period, point blank. This is hosted by Temple Number 11 every year. Like you can plan a year in advance, because rain, snow, or shine, they gonna be here. I'm gonna be here. It's just what it is. You can plan this every year. My back, here's the chairman. It's every fun. every year more, right? What date every year? Do the date change? They don't never change. Uh, do ways on October 14th. Do the time change? Time don't change. 12 noon, we out here every year. Every year. Look, we got to take off work, make a sacrifice for your nation. If you truly believe that this is for you, and you want to represent, and you want to make sure that you can't expect others to honor it if you don't honor it. So honor your day, honor your forefathers. Make the sacrifice. Let work know. Right now, when you go back to work this week, let them know you're taking off October 14th. Next year. It's long. <laughs> it's long. Because every year, this is what it's going to be. This is what it's going to be. Every year. I'm, I, since I found out about it, I've been here every year. Period. Point blank. And 
in Baltimore. We'll be starting a legacy in Baltimore that we'll be doing every year. And, and you know, certain things like this got to happen. You know, so you can understand the historical account of your ancestors. Got to understand the historical account of your ancestors. You know what I'm saying? The historical account, man, how they took the name Negro, Black, and Colored and labeled you that and put it into law. That if you call yourself that, refer to yourself that, you are disenfranchised. And just because you got a good job, just because, just because you didn't found a little bit, a uh, uh, little office on, on the, on the, on the highest floor in the skyscraper, that don't mean nothing. That don't mean nothing. That don't mean nothing. You still are in servitude. You know what I mean? Y'all free yourself, family. Y'all free yourself, man. Praise be to Allah, man, for the Moorish Americans. Honor to the Prophet, you know? Look at this. Look at this, man. We got our own history building. Look at the Moor. We taking over Philly. No, look at, that's my, that's, that's my digital mufti right there. <laughs> And, and bro, I ain't gonna tell you his name because then y'all gonna try to block him. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, that's my digital mufti right there. Y'all don't know, he be on Morris World TV waiting for y'all to act up. That's right. So, family, I'm gonna be live again. I need to get to the next location and set up. I'm gonna be live again because I want y'all to get this information. This is my brother right there. Mufti on deck. It is what it is. The man. Prophet Uber Dr. Ali said, the value of something is only worth the protection that you put on. Mufti on death. Salute. Islam.